hope springs eternal in the aching heart of Lyceum coach Topex Robinson. Despite falling to San Beda for the second straight year in the NCAA men's basketball finals, Robinson is not losing hope for his squad. Like last season, the Pirates lost their chance at quenching a burning thirst for the title after succumbing to the Red Lions in two games in the championship series, losing Game 1 73-60 and Game 2 on Monday 71-56. I'm still proud of what we have achieved, said Robinson, adding that he will keep on pushing and working his players until they reach their goal of finally winning the crown. He didn't say, though how long he intends to keep pushing. Compared to San Beda, which has won an unprecedented 22nd title, Lyceum has yet to clinch a crown since joining the league in 2011. Twice they got close to a historic first, but the title had remained elusive to the Pirates. Robinson expects next season's campaign to be tougher following the exit of star player CJ Perez and Jess Perea, but maintain he will not rely on a player or two to get them pointed to their goal. I'm expecting that everyone will fill in the void left by CJ, Robinson said, who also hoped that big man Mike Nzusu will stay for another year. For Perez, who is heading to the PBA with the number one pick label looming over him, there are no regrets. It's a wonderful journey for us, especially for me, to play for Lyceum and to play in the finals. We gave our best, but obviously, they, San Beda, are the better team, said Perez in Filipino. Perez, who won last year's MVP, also has kind words for his teammates and wishes them on their journey without him next year. I'll always be here to support the team. I told them to always give their best so that there will be no regrets in the end, Perez added.